Contrasting. Contrasting refers to the act of highlighting the differences or disparities between two or more things. It allows us to compare and contrast different elements, ideas, or characteristics to better understand their distinctions. When we contrast, we focus on the dissimilarities or contrasting features of the subjects being compared. Contrasting can be used in various contexts, such as literature, art, science, or everyday conversations. Here are some examples to help illustrate the concept. 1. Literature. In a novel, the author may use contrasting characters to emphasize their different personalities or beliefs. For instance, in Charles Dickens' A Tale of Two Cities, the characters of Sidney Carton and Charles Darnay are contrasting figures. Carton is depicted as a cynical and self-destructive man, while Darnay is portrayed as noble and virtuous. 2. Art. Artists often use contrasting colors or textures to create visual impact and highlight differences. For example, in Vincent van Gogh's painting, Starry Night, he contrasts the warm, vibrant colors of the sky with the dark, swirling patterns of the cypress tree creating a striking contrast between light and darkness. 3. Science. In scientific research, contrasting variables are used to test hypotheses and analyze data. For instance, in an experiment studying plant growth, one group of plants may be exposed to sunlight while another group is kept in the dark. By contrasting these two conditions, Scientists can observe and analyze the effects of light on plant growth. 4. Everyday conversations. Contrasting is commonly used in everyday conversations to express differences or preferences. For example, if someone asks you about your favorite type of music, you might say, I enjoy both classical and rock music, but I prefer classical because of its soothing melodies and elegant compositions. In contrast, rock music has a more energetic and rebellious vibe. In summary, contrasting is a valuable tool for highlighting differences and understanding the distinctions between various elements. It allows us to compare and contrast different aspects, whether in literature, art, science, or everyday conversations. By using contrasting techniques, we can gain a deeper understanding of the subjects being compared.